This is Mersha from Life24 Ambulance Services. Uh, one of our ambulances, as you can see at the back here, had an accident just outside of uh, Pretoria on the R573. Um, they hit a hippopotamus. At this stage, um, our driver is very critical and one of our other medics um, as a what we believe is a head injury we um, we were just in time as a fire department cut out our driver we ask for everyone's prayers they are really good people we sacrifice our lives every day to save others Please give your time to pray for our medics. Um, we really need your support at this stage. And the only thing we ask is pray, 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 pray for them. They have been transported to Mama Lori Hospital. Um, this happened in front of, um, as you can see at the back there, uh, the sign says Department of Agriculture, Rodeplat, Evaluation Center. The hippopotamus was removed already. Um, we don't care about the vehicle, we don't care about anything. We care about our medics. And um, they came from Mill Park in Johannesburg. They were on their way back home to Denilton when they were, were dispatched to another call in Kwamishlanga and it was on the R573 road uh, between Pretoria and Kwamishlanga where this accident happened. So I would really appreciate everybody's thoughts and prayers. Um, we will update a bit later to say what the condition is of our people and um, we just want to thank each and every person that was here tonight to assist us. All EMS workers, the public, fire brigade that worked so hard to get him out of here. We never thought he would get out of here alive. Our vehicle really looks horrific. Um, there's a part of the vehicle. Um, that hippopotamus was extremely huge um i will walk to the hippopotamus now if if you would like to see it um, just um i'm on my way there now i've got the people from the uh, newspapers is yeah um I don't know what's going to happen to the hippopotamus. I never would have thought anything like this can ever be possible. Uh, as I said, I can just um, ask for your support in the form of prayers for our paramedics. <sighs> Guys. Uh, I must say I'm, I'm a bit scared of this animal although they say it's dead it is unbelievably big unbelievably unbelievably big mm, uh, as I said I will update you later from Shoal Blake and all the staff working at Life24 Ambulance Services. Our thoughts and prayers are with our beloved, beloved, beloved medics. We thank you.